It's a new week, and that means a new lineup of shows to watch. Senior writer Damian Holbrook is giving us his cheers and jeers for the week. We're giving a big Comic-Con cheers to Supernatural. They knew how to kick off their panel. They were on Sunday, which is the last day, and notoriously one of the smaller days because everyone's heading out of San Diego, but they opened their panel with Kansas performing Wayward Son, the song from the show. And that just completely blew the minds of the crowd in Hall H. That is exactly what Comic-Con's supposed to be about. A big event, something surprising for the fans, and then they went into a panel where Jensen and Jared are so great with the fans, so I give them a huge Comic-Con cheers for that. Another big cheers to Lucifer. Lucifer dropped a big shocker when they announced that they had cast Tom Welling from Smallville as a new love interest for Chloe Decker. This is big because A, we've got all these superhero shows and we kind of suspected Welling would show up maybe on Supergirl as one of those like legacy characters that they love to cast. But him going to Lucifer, that's a big get for them and I think it's gonna be a really, really exciting season for them. I'm Lucifer Morningstar. I can play the piano and I'm a fancy British man. Jeers to not a lot of big news coming out of San Diego this summer. Nothing really exciting about Game of Thrones. Westworld didn't drop us any kind of information, no special guest that really blew people away except for the Kansas thing. One of those things that we all like and people spend so much time and money on, on Comic-Con is they, they want that special moment and there weren't a lot of special moments coming out this year. It was kind of low key for a Comic-Con. I'm Damian Holbrook, senior writer for TV Guide Magazine. For those shows and everything else on TV, pick up your new issue of TV Guide Magazine on Stands Now.